Hello. Good afternoon, good morning, and good evening. So, for today's video, we have a mail call from Daruana. Alright. So, again, welcome to Sumo Rock Luna. I almost forgot. And we have a mail call. From one of the toy sellers, Laruana. You can check out his page on Facebook. And their items are more on DD Toy. So this is my first time. To have or that we will unbox. DD Toys item. So we will check what will be the item that we have right here. So shout out to you, Sir Patrick, for the fast delivery from Garuana. Okay, so let's open this one up. So if you if you are a fan of a Marvel, especially for an Iron Man, and you want to collect the Hall of Armor, I suggest that you try to check the level one of page because for me, for my very own opinion, DD Toys has a very good detail for the action figure for Iron Man. All right, especially if you want to collect Hall of Armor. Now, oh, okay. Inside the box, we have. Thank you, Sir Patrick, for the actual T-shirt and Toki bag of Deadpool with the X-Men T-shirt. Very nice. Very awesome with the freebies and the sticker. Thank you. So, guys, here you go. Let me just give you this one. So, here you go. This is this page. So, you might try to check out the page on Facebook. All right. So, shout out to you, Sir Patrick, and the Laruana team. Thank you for this wonderful item. So basically, we have two ZD Toys items. So one is the ZD Toys Marvel Game Burst Wolverine. If you can notice here. Alright. So very good packaging as you can see right now what we will be unboxing actually first is the oh uh, let's say let's unbox both for today's video it might take some time but all right let's put first uh we have the other one game verse zd toys marvel game vs zd toys deadpool and the other one is wolverine so Let's start with a box. Pretty neat details for the box of ZD Toys. Okay, as you can see here, and you can see the authentic. Oh, sorry, the sticker that is under Disney. Here, you can see this. So this will indicate the authenticity of the action figure that is under ZD Toys. Now, um, on the front, the embossed, Jap uh, I think this is Chinese, for the game verse name under Marvel side, still on uh, the game verse logo, right? At the back, the Wolverine 
figure with the poses and what's um, inside the box, the action figure and the base or the, or the stand and alternate cloth. On the other box, same thing with the Zongdong toy brand barcode to make it authentic. Alright. So there you have it for Wolverine. Very neat. Uh, this is 10 out of 10 for me. Very awesome. Box that they have for Wolverine. Now, let me just try to check how. I uh, need to slide. Oh, there. So, as well for. Because this is my first time to have this particular item. The box is a magnetic type, which is awesome here. On the right side corner, I just need to pop it up. It's a magnetic. See? So, when you open it, this is the actual figure that we have right now. See? Very awesome. Thank you. Very awesome. Larana for the ZD Toys item. So let's remove it from the box. Okay. Oops, sorry. So after removing it from the box, no additional items included. Put this one back. Now, for the clamshell at the back, this is the alternate claws or alternate hand with claw and the base there then the actual item Wolverine okay whoa so let me just put it down for a while do another alcohol <laughs> okay hmm Mmm, smells new. <laughs> Just kidding. Guys. All right, so weight wise, it's very light. Okay. Let's cover this one. So let's talk first um, with the ZD Toys Wolverine game verse the height before we go on the articulation. So it's pretty light as I notice when I remove it from the clamshell. Height, just to give you a hint, it's at around 7 inch scale model. So comparison with, with the Blue Beetle McFarlane, it's a 7 inch scale. So it's just meant bent me but overall they have the same scale of seven inches okay all right now so this one it's if this one if you can see it's a little bit um wavy or not aligned you can fix it with the hot water or a blower there, so that you can straighten up for the Wolverine mask now details, let's go on the details first. Pretty awesome details as you can see here. Okay. Hold on a second. Right there. Very detailed with the face. Then let's go to head articulation. Pretty nice. Can do 360. There. Costume detailed. Very nice. It's um, somehow the same with the iconic, like the tiger costume. The iconic costume for Wolverine. But the difference is the color of the belt. It is black. Alright. And the groin part color usually it's blue right uh, so it became yellow complete yellow suit overall for the legs a different um is this a game first type different appearance for the boots or for the details of on the legs you can see here there okay 
So now, articulation for the arms, pretty good. Due to the armor padding, it is actually like a butterfly joint. But still, irritatable. Mm -hmm. Up crunch is a little bit, um, I think this is the same. It can pull back, pull up and down. But overall, up crunch is 10 out of 10 with the arms as well for the articulation. Front. Just press it a little bit. I'll find the raise it then the elbow bendable it's like in the knee so it's very awesome okay See? legs pretty much it cannot do split okay it can only do until like a, a 20 degrees leg raise for the back but bendable so there um, articulation wise overall for me <clears throat> because uh, it's not same as um, other articulated action figure but still overall it's 9 out of 10 for the articulation alright so now let me just put the ring here so that you can enjoy how it is good looking for Wolverine. So let me just set up <coughs> its base and the al alternate hand which has claw claws I mean. So these are the alternate hands like I mentioned. So again you can just pop it out. Okay. Just change this one. For me, I just wish that GD Toys created the game vs. Wolverine. Um, the alternate hand is with the claw, it's closed fist. That's my only opinion. And then the <clears throat> alternate hand is palms open. That has no claw. So that it will be more, you know fierce for the claw itself for Wolverine now for the base so this is how it looks like for the base okay so there's the Marvel game verse actual logo here in Chinese or I think this is Korean, most likely. I don't know. With, try, um, with their trademark logo. Okay. Then this is how it looks like for the stand. Pretty neat. It is somehow, um, if you can remember, it, or if you have collected hot toys or crazy toys, the stand is somehow similar with this. Okay, for the fam. So that it can stand our action figure. Now, okay, setting it up for a better, oh, pretty tight here. There. So it can turn, guys, 360 degrees for the stand. Now for the clip, okay, turn it up and down. No left and right. All right. But again, uh, for this particular item, it can stand alone with or without the, the, the base or the stand for the CD toys. Okay. See, so uh, I prefer that this one has a close fist with a claw. So that it's much more awesome. Okay. So there you have it, guys. So we have the first unboxing of the ZD Toys Wolverine Gameverse Edition. Okay. So don't expect too much that. 
the particular item is the same with the comic version. They have um, different costume, uh, how do you call it, design. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Now, next is the ZD toy. Hold on. Next, we will unbox is the ZD Toys Gameverse Deadpool series. So it goes in here. The background. So for the box, for the box itself, it's the same as the ZD Toys Wolverine, as you can see here. It has the game verse, Marvel game verse on top, and the Zoo Toys logo, a Chinese on the top logo, and then the actual Deadpool game verse image with the Marvel game verse under uh, Chinese in both as well. You can roughly touch it. And with the authenticity sticker from Disney that it is very authentic. You can see here, there. Right and the name, Deadpool. So this is a one tenth scale Super War collection there. I forgot to mention earlier to Deadpool. It has that um, these details below the box. So it's a seven inch scale, the one tenth scale edition. Alright, and on the side the Deadpool logo, so here is in the magnetic part of the box, on the right, you got it side there, and on the top, oh sorry, on the back is the actual Deadpool, the Deadpool action figure with the poses, front and back, and the base, with the base, with the other details on this particular item, okay? And then the it's translated in Chinese, um, the hazard barcode as well, and yeah, you can scan it as well on the app if you have an app for this one. So there you go. So now inside the box for the Gameverse Marvel Gameverse Deadpool. So this is how it looks like. Pretty awesome. Shout out again to you, Lorana, for this wonderful item. Thank you so much. So at the back with the clamshell, same goes like Wolverine is with the base, alternate hands, and the weapons and the stand with the alternate. Oh, the weapons. Um, it has two katanas. Two special um, dagger or knife with the handgun. Alright, awesome. Let me just open this one up. And the actual action figure here. So now it's. Oh, so this is the actual difference between the two. Wolverine doesn't have this cloth or plastic to. Secure the freshness, more secure freshness for the action figure. Especially, it is a Deadpool. If you can remember, um, there there is an upcoming movie for the Deadpool Three movie. Brian Reynolds and Hugh Jackman. So most likely, these particular items or toys will increase the volume once the movie is released. All right now after the commercial next we'll go on the details so for my review very awesome costume detail for the game verse edition of this Deadpool because what I noticed is on some of the action figures for Deadpool there is no armor pad or shoulder pad here but this one it has and it look it looks like you know, you are a samurai now, for the armor padding. Pretty iconic. So this is um, more on a comic version for the head sculpt. You can notice there, the 
it's a fat, it's like a ponytail, right? But still the same awesome head sculpt figure here for the Deadpool, very common. And articulation of the head, you can do 360 degrees there, very tight joint. For the arms, oh sorry, for the body, very nice. It's a combination of, I can say the comic version because of this one for the mask, but the body costume, it's somehow the same with the movie um, costume of Deadpool. You can see here. With um, the katana strap on the back, oh, at the, on the front, there. It's supposed to be black, but this one it is brown, or looks like leather, so it's brown. Very good detail. At the back here, you can see where you're gonna insert the actual katana sword. Alright? And it is, I think, removable. And if you have watched, um, as well, or you can check out as well, Brain Cifra's page, YouTube page. Uh, I know you already unboxed and gave some feedback for the Deadpool um, Gameverse edition. Very cool. Thank you, Sir Rain Cifra. Then the logo on the waist with the belt part for Deadpool, as you can see there. With, oh, it's movable. I didn't notice this. With the pouches or pouches very detailed as well then the handgun the holster for your handgun you can put here now this one i don't know uh you can just put it or slip it here the side Then another holster for the small dagger. So I don't know which dagger because there is a small one and a this dagger. Let's try this one, the, the semi-long. Okay, uh, checking further. Okay, so this one, it does not fit in, so probably the smallest dagger. So it's pretty small, guys. Sorry, here. There. So that one fits exactly on this particular hole set. Okay. Now, with the arms, I almost forgot. Very good detail with the forearm guard. looks like a samurai then a ninja that's for my opinion only okay and then the shin guard the regular shin guard the same thing with the deadpool series okay very good actually details overall 10 out of 10 for me pretty cool articulation let's go on articulation shoulders left and right you can do 360 degrees forward and backward raise there T raise okay 10 out of 10 up crunch up crunch movement pretty much 10 out of 10 as well there swing oh it can do 360 there 360 degrees very nice. Now for the legs, let's see. Oh, pretty neat. So, comparison base for Wolverine and Deadpool. This guy, this action figure Deadpool can raise up to 45 degrees. There we go. Mm, still cannot do splits, but so it's a great deal that it can do. A 45 degree angle because or a 90 degree angle because this is a actually like um, 
agile, you know, for the Deadpool. Very swift and agile movement. Then knee bending, pretty nice, double joint as well. So overall, it's 10 out of 10 for me. Both articulation, so again guys, it can be removed. 10 out of 10 for the articulation and a very good detail GD toys. Thank you so much for this one. Now, let me show you guys. Here are the weapons. First is the katana. We already, I already shown you guys the actual. gun earlier and the two daggers this one I um this one I need to check on which particular because there's no more oh there we go there's another holister I didn't notice just below the right ankle so this one this is where you're gonna put the long knife or the dagger there okay so same thing, same thing with the base, same with Wolverine, no name for Deadpool, only the Gameverse logo, Marvel Gameverse logo here, still the same, and the stand itself, so I almost forgot that this particular, this particular base stand, this is a spring, it returns back. Not like the hot toys, if I can recall it. It's not um, spring type. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? Come on. There we go. Let's prepare the beat. Then next, let me just change the whoop, the handset or the hand. So it came with two set of alternate hands. You can see left and right. Open, open palm, and then semi-closed fist for insertion of weapons. Oh, okay. Let me close it up. That that ball looks like jumping with his katana. Whoa! Look insertion. Whoa! And the details of the katana is pretty nice, if I can say so myself. Because of the pre... Oh, let me just provide you that one. Because of the details, especially on the... Where you're gonna... Where the action figure will hold the, act, the actual weapon. See? Very detailed. Okay.
oh sorry this is the actual ZB Toys Deadpool action figure and this is a game version it's very bendable until it's a bat or a sword. Yeah. All right. So there you have it, guys. Again. Again, this is Sumura Luna, and thank you for watching for the unboxing of our two new item from La Rana, Sir Patrick and providing us this cool toys from ZD Toys, Gamers, Deadpool and Wolverine. Alright, so stay tuned guys for upcoming unboxing of toys and reviews. Just a simple review for my end. And again, thank you for watching guys. Hope you enjoy. So please do like, share and follow my page Sumo Rock Luna on Facebook, TikTok and YouTube. All right. So thank you for watching. God bless and happy collecting everyone. Please do check out again Laruana's page at Facebook and if you want to order some pretty cool Iron Man um, armor under ZD, ZD Toys brand you might need to check that out they have it all all right so again thank you for watching peace out and goodbye